After weeks of wrestling with activists over abortion bans due to the Wuhan virus, Texas is suddenly allowing them after lifting restrictions on non-essential procedures. A month ago, Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton ordered a ban on abortions, a day after Catholic Governor Greg Abbott put a stop to non-essential medical procedures. He ordered that through April 21st, any medical worker participating in abortions be fined $1,000 or face up to 180 days in jail. Lower courts declared the order unconstitutional, but on Monday, the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals ruled the ban covering all abortions, including chemical abortions, legal. On Friday, Abbott commented that any abortion ban will be a decision for courts to make. But on Tuesday, he announced Texas would open up for business and on Wednesday allowed abortion mills to open as long as they don't interfere with hospital operations that would treat Wuhan virus patients. Late Wednesday night, the state dropped the matter, saying there is no longer a case or controversy. Six other states have relegated abortion as non-essential. Alabama, Arkansas, Louisiana, Ohio, Oklahoma, and Tennessee. But several Democratic-run states, Florida, Massachusetts, Michigan, Minnesota, New Jersey, New York, North Carolina, and Virginia have called abortion essential. Abortion activists are ecstatic over the news and went right back to business. And while just over 560 people have died from the virus in the Lone Star State, many more unborn children will continue to die. J.P. Severini, Church Militant, Detroit.